today we had a workshop with uh, FSDT in terms of uh, discussing the new alternative to lending. Uh, that is actually quite different from the conventional lending. Uh, we will be developing a credit scoring model. Credit scoring model is a mathematical tool uh, that is used to estimate the likelihood of default of a particular bowler at any given time, uh, given a certain unforeseeable event. Uh, such as bankruptcy, liquidation, and so forth, or the missing payment. In financing farmers, uh, we really miss the data. Uh, they don't document most of the, the activities that they're doing, they don't document the cost that they're incurring. But through these data that, that we have gone through today and making sure that we'll be having it in the platform that it will be available for everybody, it will help the financial institution to make sure that um, they have the proper data with the proper information to make sure that they can save these farmers. In Kilimbiro, um, we have our growers who currently rely on normal products and solutions, um, but we recognize that financial institutions have struggled to find appropriate products and solutions um, in the grower environment, whereas now with the advent of technology and, and data-driven management systems, um, we're in a far better position to be able to unlock that potential and mostly to de-risk that environment. This initiative which is being done by FSVT, we are positive that it will impact our farmers because at the moment the data was offline which was not of value to these smallholder farmers. So you will find smallholder farmers uh, have transacted a lot of amount but the data is not online. So if we combine offline data and online data, I'm sure the farmers, their credit worth will grow and it will impact their production at the end of the day. I think from a banking perspective, there's a lot of areas, one for collaboration and also for driving financial inclusion. It's always been difficult to lend to smaller scale farmers because of a lack of understanding, um, a lack of data on credit worthiness. Um, so it's amazing to see that the work is going on now into building a scorecard that will enable financial institutions to provide financial services to them.